Hello everybody, today we're going to show you how to make your own salt art. So this is super cool, fun 3D art that you can make using things you have at home. So all you're going to need is a piece of paper, we're using cardstock but normal paper could work too. Um, some glue, now it has to be the liquid glue because the glue sticks aren't going to work for this and you're going to see why. Some paint, watercolor paints, or if you don't want to use watercolors, you can also use chalk. And I'm going to show you how to do that, and Heather's going to show you how to do it with watercolor. And lastly, you're going to need some salt. So we have a whole bowl full of salt here, so we're ready to go. Hold on. So we need a design. We need they a design. They need to think of what they want to okay. do. So hang on. So, so, so let's, let's think. Do you have a cool design in mind? Jellyfish. Jellyfish. Oh, my gosh. Um, blue whales. Whales. I'm going to totally do the blue whale. I'll try a jellyfish. Okay, so Heather's going to go ahead with her design. My first step actually is that I'm going to take some salt. I'm going to put it on this little piece that I have right here, and I'm going to make the color that I want. So if I'm doing an octopus, what color would I need? Purple. Purple. Very good. So I'm going to take my purple chalk, and I'm just going to go ahead and rub into my salt. And it's really fun makes this really cool sound. Hmm. I'm gonna add some pink to make it more purple. And you're noticing I'm dyeing the color of my salt. So I don't need to paint it. I already have my colored salt. And while she's doing that, I am going to pour some salt on my glue. Mm. from before. Now, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to shake it lightly to see if I can make it stick and back onto my plate. So the first round was pretty good. Oops. Well, looks like I got a fun little stripe on my octopus. So now I'm going to keep going until every piece of glue has salt on it. So I might add some waves to mine. So I'm going to take some more salt, there you go, and I'm going to make some blue salt, like that, oh it's so fun, that's a cool sound too. So All right. the cool thing with the paint and the salt is when you dip the paint and you go near the salt, it should take so now the salt is turning blue. Need some more blue. Welcome back. Here's our finished pieces. Do you guys like them? This is my silly octopus. And this is Heather's really cool. Blue whale. Blue whale. So we hope you like this activity. Thanks so much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.